This is Paul's last few moments to convey the message of hope and love and forgiveness to the community. When I looked at this screenplay, I was amazed at the survival of Christianity rests with just a couple, couple of people. Yeah, I mean, he, he hasn't done a biblical film since The Passion of the Christ and said that he's turned down all of them because he didn't feel like anything felt relevant. And so when he read this and he saw what was kind of going on with the Christian community in the first century and with Nero and Rome, it just, yeah, it just affected him. And, and it was a story that he wanted to be a part of. And then James Faulkner was a gift from God. I mean, truly, truly, um, he's in, incredible in the movie. And I mean, even as Jim Caviezel said uh, the other day that he was born to play Paul. But that was a, I don't want to say last minute addition to the cast, but we had um, we had gone through a number of other uh, options. And, um, you know, it just takes time to get people to read it and respond and have conversations. We were and, on Malta ready to shoot two weeks before. Yep. And... We had cast uh, another actor and, and various circumstances happened and James came along at the 11th hour. And I mean, when you see the film, he's it was clearly God looking out for us because he's amazing. He I believe the quote was he is uh, to Paul what Christopher Reeve is to Superman. And it's true. <laughs> he should win the award for the certainly the best actor, but the best beard in, in history. It's uh it's, best beard on film. Yeah, best beard Absolutely. on film. You'll never see a better one. He's, <laughs> he's an amazing man, and he's humble, and he's he should be. He's the the male uh, Helen Mirren. I mean, he's just mm. a class act. But he's also built his career in such a way that he he keeps a family life. He hasn't his career hasn't exploded. He's worked for thirty years, so it's, it's exciting to to kind of introduce him to a new audience and uh, mm -hmm. the role he's bringing this man to life.